This here is the Pagan Wall. It's about 20 kilometers long, I think. And um, it was built by the pharaohs. Because we can find the same sort of attachments here, which we can find in, uh, in Amarna, in Upper Egypt, with the sort of... Uh, a log out of wood, you know, so the stones are being connected. Um, so it's definitely the pharaohs who made this. They're the only ones who can do these things, you know. So here's the pagan wall. Uh, as in Egypt, as in Upper Egypt, they uh, they took the sand here with water and then they uh, they made like concrete. They 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 poured it like together at the place you can see this because there are all these little stones in here so you know they just mixed it on place Well, this is the way they did it, and we can find this also in uh, in Egypt. In uh, the pharaohs did it this way, in uh, upper Ama upper Egypt, in Amarna, where Ek Eknaton, where he's from, so where he was. So they lock it in, you know, two stones together, and uh, so they they hold together. But they um, they made a sort of a concrete, you know. I think we find this in South America as well with the pyramids and all that. It's all the same bunch who did it. You know. This is concrete. I mean, look at all these little stones here. This is uh, uh, prehistoric, pharaonic concrete. They probably did the pyramids like this. I mean, this is the. Uh, there's no mystery. They just they just took the sand up, and then they took the water up in the water bags. I mean, uh, and then they just mixed it, make concrete, pyramid concrete. And then they, uh, they let it dry for 4,000 years. I mean, it gets really hard eh, in the sun. It gets hard as, uh, you know. So, this is in, uh, in the east of France here, next to Strasbourg. It's called the Mont Saint-Odile. It's a real big pagan wall, probably not even pagan. I mean, they call it the pagan wall. Le Mur Païen, the Heidenmauer. And it's real long, real long. They did a lot of job, a lot of work here. So when the pharaohs came here, you know, they had to uh, protect themselves, you know, and, and hide. So that's why they made the. Uh, the Pagan Wall, probably one of their first settlements in, uh, or one of the settlements in Northern Europe. Or maybe this is the place they, where they landed, who knows man, who knows. It's all part of the Pagan Wall. night by the way it gets real scary here I don't know there's something I don't know what you know. some energy real strong energies here We can see again how they uh, attach the stones together here and there. But that was part of the uh, making the concrete. You know, they just uh, when it was still wet, they put the uh, the wooden log in there, so it, it held. Well, here we can even see it better. There, 
you know, they moved apart, but they were like together, you know, in one line. I'll take the branches away in a minute. And we find the same thing in Egypt. So these guys did it like 4,000 years ago, maybe longer in Europe. So that's that long day already here. And here's another one. I'll take the branches away. Take the stuff away. And take the stuff away here. <clears throat> there. You see? Nice log in here. So these guys have been here like for thousands of years, you know, at least. At least 4,000 years, as I say. So this here fitted together like with this one here, you know, like this. Uh, the, the stone, the stone moved, the big one here, it moved. But uh, we find the same things in, uh, in Egypt, in upper, upper Amarna. So uh, these guys did it, you know. They've been here for ages. They've been always been here. Oh yeah. There's no doubt. And don't believe what history tells you, you know, like the mainstream stuff, you know. Yeah, I'll show you the proofs. The Pharaoh's been here for 4,000 years, at least. You know, and they're ruling the world. They founded Switzerland. The Templars were Pharaohs. The Per A. The royal house. The big royal house. And the Templars, they were the poor sons. Not the first one in line, so he could take the castle, but the other ones who had to fight for it, you know. So they went to Jerusalem and they thought, well, where can we find, you know? Like today, where's the petrol? Where's the dope, Afghanistan? You know, they've always been here. All these kings and queens, you know, later on I'll show you some castles here. They've always been here. Yeah, it's a nice forest here. All the way around here. You know, what a place to hide, eh? It's really, it's magic. <laughs>